Here we go then, the final round of the 2012 South Region Summer Series. Good luck to your favourites, and it is the Ladies 30 Plus Cruiser kicking us off here at East Kent in Moto number one. And out there in front is Renee Dywell. She is the early leader in this one with Sue Farahone and Von Ryan and Natalie Edwards giving chase. There in the five, then Debbie Pierce is in the six, Carol Taylor seven, and then the six one eight of Claire Goodwin for Bad BMX in there as well. But it's Rene Diewell doing it for Gosport in the lead. Sue Farrow for Vandals. Then the battle's on for third between Natalie Edwards and Yvonne Ryan. It's still Rene Diewell out there in front. Looks like she just needs to get the last straight right to take the win. Sue Farrow gets the second. Natalie Edwards in third. Von Ryan gets the four. Debbie Pierce gets past Kirsty Hambro. The six and unders, the pocket rockets are now hitting the track and the 99 plate has gone off very quickly. That's Otto Young. Come here from Denham. Archie Alexander, the world number seven from Peckham. He's there in the mix as well. You can see Ryder Joyce in the third, who's come all the way here from Bournemouth. And he's about to go into second place, is he? No, Archie Alexander still stays firm. And now Ryder Joyce goes up the inside. And may have just grabbed that second spot, but it's Otto Young who remains the man to catch. Otto Young for Bad BMX is your leader. Here comes Ryder Joyce now. Coming past me now, it's Otto Young, your leader. Ryder Joyce in second. Tyler White trying to go out the inside of Archie Alexander. With Archie Alexander there just holding on to that third spot. But Otto Young it is, remaining the man to catch. But Ryder Joyce is chasing him down. But across the line, it's going Otto Young, your winner. Ryder Joyce gets the second. Archie Alexander in the third. Charlie Black, I can see there in the second. 4-1-4. Nathan Duper is next. 424 Ben Curling, now riding expert for Ruddy Mead. He's in the four spot. We're coming down the final straight now. Lucas Horn it is. He's going to take the win. Charlie Black in second. Nathan Duper in third. As Moto number six is already on the track. And it looks like one of the local riders has gone off to a good start here. It looks like Red was busy. For here for East Kent. In the lead, Dagenham are in there in second place, Max Reynolds. So Redford's busy. There your leader, 152, Max Reynolds is in second spot. James Whiffin for East Kent in third. Then uh, Malika Dickens Julian. And then we go back to Sam Lewis and 662, Jamie Ackerman. And Ronan Gillam is out there in all, getting a bit of hand from Dad as he goes round. But Redford's busy. That's the first one for East Kent. Let's hear ya. Redfords has done it for the local. He's got a massive future here. The starting them young down here in East Kent. I think Dad's going to be very tired by the time the afternoon's over, Sam. And Ronan Gillam will complete go round safe and sound. Eight and under novices then. The beginners out on the track. Great to see so many of the novices getting all the support they want there. As Dan Fry there, nine Troy Bezik for East Kent. Oh. Thomas Harrison. So across the line, Billy Hughes out on the road. Looking good, the winner. Ryan Bob gets the second. Callum Tupper. And then Troy Bezik. Now the big boys are out on the track. We are cruiser racing. And it looks like Connor Douglas out there in front. On the 022 play, 754, Sergio Fernandez. He's next. Carnage Carlin. How this boy is on a bike again after Hurston a couple of weeks ago is beyond me, but he's there. The 022 out there in front, already taking the win. Connor Douglas, Sergio, Kevin. And then the 099 of our Paul Andrews. We need to know if Errol McLean's racing after his crash earlier on this afternoon. Errol McLean, can you let us know if you're racing? 635, that looks like Luke Dell is it. Out there in front, Luke Dell is your leader. Michelle Eaton is out there for the girls and she's just been brought down. Oh! Michelle Eaton decided to ride with the boys today and uh, unfortunately it hasn't worked out for her in this one. 
But out there in front, the four X of Billy Stuffle, who is your leader? Luke Dell is there in the two. Justin Essen in three. So coming down the stroke, Stuffle gets the win. Dell in second, Justin Essen in third. That is Gregory Mead. So we'll see them back later on. Kai Riviera, I can see, got away pretty good there. That moto number 16, Keith Wilson is in there as well. It looks like we've got a catch. The 199 is that Shane Trotter come here all the way from Bournemouth. Shane Trotter is your leader. Kai Riviera is there in the two. Wilson is there in three. And then you've got a gap then back to Wong and Letchford. And now Kai Riviera. He's trying to chase down and going up the inside. But Shane Trotter hangs on. Final straight, Callum Gregory is going to take the win. Well, in second place, Daniel Horton. And then uh, Rostell getting the three spot. 12 year old experts once again on the track. And it is your man out there in front for East Kent, Joel Lockhart, your leader. The boy who knows this track very well and if he had his way would still be here at three in the morning practicing. Look at him go. It is Joel Lockhart, your leader for East Kent. The number 15, he's out in the second spot. That looks like Kobe Dickens Studio. 922 is next. Except there isn't one. I think that's Obi Hagen there on a different plate of what he's registered. Under. Aisha McClelland mixing it with the boys again this time around. She's in the fourth place and going round James Horwood for the third. And it's going to be a close one across the line. As uh, James Ryan ended up coming across that line first. And got... So we've got a charity rider out there. Which number is it, Leslie? The 999, Nigel Kays. He's doing this for charity today. I hope he's wearing that too, too. Any excuse, Nigel, A. Eh? As across the line, look like uh, the 19, the Charlie Wilshire there. So another win there for East Kent. OK. So that's Nigel K then doing it for cancer research. Well done to him. A 6-1-3, Lee Cutler is down, he's doing quick line in that veterans room. Jason King, second. Sorry, it was Matt Hayward, sorry, who come across the line, the winner. Jason King getting the two as they were going into veterans racing. And it looks like Team Vandal's out there. I think that's Martin Parker out there in front. Then Rich Stevens in there. Tony Twist, Kevin Carlin and Phil Beer. Tony Twist trying to go out the inside there, Rich Stevens, but Martin Parker is the man to catch. And they're in front as regional elite there, their first moto hitting the track. And now they're in front. It looks like Super Mario has gone in front there for race day video. It's Mario Pressi celebrating his national series win. Double seven four, Connor Douglas in there as well. And then we've got the number 12 in the mix in third spot, Tommy Parker. Where it's Mario Lee and Connor. Then uh, Tommy Parker and Gabor Deli in the four. And Mario Pressi easing down. And you're up next, round two. Away we go, and one rider completely stacks it there on the first, uh, on the start straight. Uh, Billy Luckhurst and Dan Pullen, you're one, two. Then Quillen is the door, the world number one. Only having himself a fourth place at the minute. But it's Billy Luckhurst, your leader. Pullen in second. Look at Harley Kelly there in the third. Quillen is the door, is in four. That's going down. Pass me now, Luckhurst and Pullen. Then we got Kelly, Quillen is the door. Then George Higley in the five. Coming across the line now. The win will go to Billy Luckers. Here they go. Ready, die well. Having to come from the hard way around to 
take this one as she uh, took the first moto and it's Natalie Edwards out there in front for Hurston. This time around, Rennie Diewell trying to catch Sue Horton in there, Von Ryan in the four, and Kirsty Hamrett and Debbie Pierce, Carol Taylor and... Uh, Claire Goodwin. But Natalie Edwards coming past me now. Looking good for the Hurston youngster there. Out in front. Rennie Diewell in the two. Susan Farahone in three with Yvonne Ryan. We're going down the final straight. Natalie Edwards takes it on her cruiser. Rennie Diewell gets the second. Sue Farahone in third and Yvonne Ryan in fourth. Of Ella Junker, Grace Bryceland is next, and then the 592 of Megan Gregory. So, Megan Nicard it is, who I think is going to make it two out of two here. Taking that win from Megan Gregory and Kelsey Pryor. Ten-year-old experts now on the track. This is moto number 64. And he's the South champion from uh, Cyclo Park last year, Matthew Harmon, involved in a huge battle with Matthew Hutt for that title last year. Don't you like Matthew's here? Matthew Hutt's here today, so Matthew Harmon leading this one from the number seven of Connor Hedges. And it's close on the line. Another one for you, Tina, that one. Ben Hodgson gets the three. The head of Josh Werner. Ten-year-old experts now once again. Another round for them. This time Kobe Joyce, who was the National Series winner from last year. And British champion as well. I think he got third this year in the National Series and at the end of all that. He's out there in front this time around. Fights Jack Bodman for Bournemouth in the two spot. And then I think that might be Evan Watson there in the three. Well, Kobe Joyce will come across the line. Your winner of this one, Jack Bodman and Evan Watson in the third. McCulloch is trying to chase her down. But Olivia Howard coming down the final straight. Looks like she's going to hang on here. Daniel Cullock and Megan Nevard. Sorry, Taylor Nevard getting the third. Megan Doohig in the fourth. As I took it out and got five. So, Moto 69, this is the girls again. This is the 15 and 16 year old. You'll see Shamika Shaw out there for Peckham. Victoria Gallup for Scooter there in the uh, two. Natalie Edwards in three. Kiri Goodwin, I think that is in. We're going down the final straight now. Shamika Shaw, does she hang on? Oh, what do you mean? Rich Deep for Vandals, bad BMX in the four. So, uh, coming down the final straight, Rob Horn is your winner. Martin Parker gets the second, Tony Twist in third. As the next round of vets on the track is Nigel White and Neil Stewart fighting for the lead in this one. Kevin Carlin and Phil Beer, they're not that far behind either, so this could be a very close finish, girls. On the start line, on the finish line, I should say. Neil Stewart and Nigel White, you're one and two. Kevin Carlin and Phil Beer, three and four. But now all four of them, and Phil Beer going up the inside there, trying to move, and Neil Stewart has gone from first to last in one hit.